Hey, what is up everyone? Ready here and today we're going to be playing a game on Roblox called Those Who Remain by Peak Development Studios. Now before we get straight into this game, let's go ahead and read the description. And we'll survive endless waves of infected while looting for items to keep you and your friends alive. We highly suggest running the game on 5 plus graphics settings to experience the full appeal of all of the maps. Alright, and here's some more information. So if you want to pause the video and take a look at some of that, you can. Alrighty, let's go ahead and let's get into the game. Alrighty, so we just got into the game and we have some options here. And this background is actually really cool, by the way. So it says, those who remain. It says, play endless classic hardcore server list. We're going to go ahead and click play. Let's see what this is all about. So it's joining server, TWR server. Okay. So it's going to load them. We can just go ahead and hit skip. Make sure that graphics are all the way up. Yep. And it's a pretty cool loading screen, by the way. Oh my. Alrighty. Um, just gonna hit ready. Looks like we have a bunch of options here, too. And this music is pretty loud. I turned on this music just a little bit. There we go. Now we're going to go ahead and we're going to wait until everyone readies up. Alrighty, so it gives us a way of where we can do a map vote. Now I wasn't able to vote, but it looks like we're loading into the map cabin. Now this sounds pretty interesting. I was spectating some players earlier and the game looks really cool so far, but I still don't know too much about it. But once we get right in, everything should be pretty cool. All right, so we just made in and wave one is beginning. Now it's kind of really dark in this game. I don't know why, but so far everything is looking really cool. And I tweaked the settings a little bit with sounds and um, just like effects and stuff. So everything should be okay. Now this cabin is actually really big. And we should explore the inside of this cabin and see what everything has here. So there's like a med kit on the floor. Uh, let's see if there's anything else. Oh, we got an energy drink. That's really cool. Some ammo. More ammo. What else? Oh, there's a zombie. Okay then. <laughs> oh wow, they ragdoll really far. That is crazy. What is that? It's barbed wire? Okay. So I wonder if we can go anywhere farther in the map. Hopefully this map isn't too small. I don't know what this is. Is this ammunition or something? No. I have no clue what this is. But looks like we get points from being here. Now, I'm not going to go over there. I'm going to try looking over in this place here see what's out here there's a lot of zombies and I can't really find the cabin right now I'm kind of lost I wonder if this is like a checkpoint or something oh object completed oh that's pretty cool so I just unlocked a new weapon too now I'll probably see if I can try and equip a different weapon after this game but I don't know how much time there will be Game. Oh, we're back at the cabin too. Alright, so we have another weapon too. So we have a shotgun. Uh, this looks like a pistol. And like a board or something. I don't know how I feel about the pistol. But this shotgun, this double barrel shotgun, uh, I'm loving this. This is great. And these zombies are really loud. So, it looks like we get a bunch of points too, and I wonder what we can buy with a lot of these points. I'm guessing we can buy weapons, but I wonder if there's anything else we can buy. Also, I, I couldn't even see that. I thought that was a zombie at first. I can't. <laughs> oh, I didn't even know there was a downstairs or a basement. Oh, this is really cool. So, there's all obtain ammo. Chain of Jack? What is that? Huh. More barbed wire. 
Now we got barbed wire, but I'm not sure how we exactly use it. And I thought I turned off blood. That's very weird. A lot of zombies, I'll say that. Wow. It's just funny how they fall apart too like that. A lot of waves too. Must be... If this is supposed to be wave one, I can't imagine how long these waves go on for when these people keep surviving. I'm guessing it gets harder as we progress. But this is already a lot of zombies to begin with. But so far, I'm actually really liking this game. I think it's really fun. Um, again, this map is pretty cool. Um, it's kind of small, but that's okay. I mean, I was hoping for maybe a bigger map, but this works. And it'd be really cool if you could use a vehicle. That'd be funny. Maybe you can, who knows. Oh, is that a map bomb? No, flap bomb. How do we use this? Okay, so I figured out what key to use, and I think it's F or something like that. Now we're, we're going to place this jack down. I don't know what this is supposed to do. Oh, okay. So we survived wave one. And we reached level six, and we unlocked some new weapons. <laughs> All right, so we made it back and we're on wave two. Now you are actually able to make classes and do a bunch of stuff. Basically by saying making classes, you can uh, go ahead and grab some new weapons. I didn't get a chance. I was looking at some stuff to buy, but hopefully next round I can find something to buy. That'd be quite cool. But yeah, so far everything is pretty good. I also tweaked the settings again so I could turn off some effects that I was seeing that probably wasn't so great. All right, so we got another task and we have to escort this person. I don't know where exactly we're escorting them, but there's like a lot of zombies out here, I believe. And I don't think we want this person to die. I think they're very important. And I think, yes, they need to get to the cabin. I'm assuming they need to get some medical supplies. And let's see what happens from there. It also gives you some hints in the game too, on the left side, in the chat bar I believe. That's pretty cool, and I think the person just disappeared. <laughs> oh yeah, I also forgot to mention, with uh, placing down things, you press F, and then you have a group of things that you can place down. So for example, oh my goodness, oh wow that was scary. So, for example, if I can... <laughs> okay, um... I'm gonna place down a bomb. This is getting scary. All right, that worked. I'm gonna also place down some fire outside here. Oh wow, that was really scary. Let's go ahead and test this barbed wire. See how good it does. Oh my goodness. Wow. A lot of them. All right, I just want to test out and see how this barbed wire works, though. First, I need to find a med kit because I'm kind of really, really low right now. And this is not too good. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna die! Oh, I just died. <laughs> so, I wanted to take a look at some of the stuff here while I'm dead in the game and before I respawn in for the next round. So you have a loadout, you can pick weapons, and as you level up, stuff gets cheaper, and you can also buy these weapons for these prices right now, or you can wait. Primaries and secondaries, and then there's also melees, so there's a bunch of cool weapons as well. Um, and there's also perks, and I believe perks are like stuff that basically increase your character and stuff. But I went ahead and I bought a new weapon as well. So I'm definitely going to test this out to see how this goes. I think this is really, really cool. I'm really 
um, enjoying the look of this weapon. I believe it's like a Ruger or something it said. But yeah, I want to take a, a shot and see how it goes. So I keep thinking this is a zombie. <laughs> All right, so we're going to take a test shot. Where's the zombie? Oh, wow. This gun is kind of quiet. But, I mean, it does some good damage. I will say that. Where's the zombie? We can also test it on still. Also going to go over the here again. If you guys want to see a part two on this game, I could definitely do that. I think this game is very enjoyable. I think it's very fun. Um, this isn't just the only map. There's tons more maps to play. Oh wow, I didn't know this was automatic. I was I was really surprised. Oh wow, you can spam it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so I just picked up some nerve gas and I was going to try this out and see what this does. And we'll see what this does to the zombies. I wonder if it like poisons them? It weakens them pretty well. Wow. This gun sounds pretty weird, but kind of cool at the same time. I'm just really surprised, like I said, how quiet it is. I'm not sure if I bought a pistol or not. I don't think I did. Yeah. I was about to buy a pistol, but I didn't. Kind of forgot to because the round started up really quick. But, yeah. Alrighty, I think that's going to be it for this video. If you all enjoyed, please leave a like. That would be greatly appreciated. Also, by leaving a like, it will help the video get out to other people as well. And also, it will help me to know if you enjoyed the video or not. And also, comment below, and I'll try to respond to your comment. I'll try to heart your comment and even leave a like on your comment. And maybe I'll just pin it. And also, by subscribing, um, you will be notified every single time I make a video when you hit the bell after subscribing as well and subscribing is completely free so if you want to go ahead and do that you can i'm not forcing you to but it'd be greatly appreciated as well um anyways thank you all for watching um i hope you all will have a great day i hope you all will stay safe stay chilling have a snazzy day and take care everyone peace out all your dreams